Desiree, I can't believe the day is finally here. I'm gonna keep it together. I'm glad that we can get married in a location that's special to both of us, where it all began. I'm excited to share this day with you and can't wait to see what the future holds for us together. And I can't wait to marry you today. Love, Josh. Hey. <laughs> How are you? you? How are you? You look very nice. <laughs> you look even better. And the note. Oh my god, what a... Did you cry? Yeah, I cried! They got it on video? Yeah, they got it on <laughs> video! You got me! Josh is the hardest working, most adventurous, most competitive person you have ever met. I've had the pleasure of growing up with Desiree. I've been to more Taco Tuesdays, wine walks, trivia nights than you'll ever know. I've always looked up to you as a person with compassion, who's hardworking, and who's lovely, and I've tried to follow in your footsteps. Although today marks the next major step in this journey, the adventure did not begin yesterday. It began seven years ago, while Desiree and Josh were out with friends at a rooftop bar in downtown Orlando. Josh, you've always been a smart, hardworking, dedicated, and loving person. And when I say smart, I mean you found Desiree. That was a really smart move. The night he made the smartest decision of our friendship, ages ago, when we decided it would be a great idea to get dressed in our finest attire, crash a co-worker's wedding, and then continue the celebration downtown, who would have known we would have bumped into this incredible woman right here? Joshua caught Desiree's attention because he was wearing a suit and blowing bubbles. So she approached him to ask if he had just come from a wedding, which he did. They hit it off and spent the rest of the night hanging out and even have a photo from the night they met. I know that you both will continue to grow and learn in your partnership together for the years to come. There are many memories to be made, adventures to be taken, and your love will know no bounds. I'm excited to watch you both flourish and cherish each other. You're too blessed to be stressed. As a father, all I ever wanted for Josh was for him to feel loved and to find a spouse that will love him as much as he loves her. And I think he's done that. Desiree, I see the love and passion in you and how you care about our son and how much he cares about you. Linda and I are so happy to have you as part of our family and to call you our daughter-in-law. Desiree, when we first met, I was amazed at how bubbly and full of energy you were. I couldn't wait to get to know you better. I love that you're beautiful, intelligent, and driven. There are a few things that I'd like to promise you today and every day. I promise to be your adventure buddy, your snowboarding guide, camping partner, your foreign travel companion, and to wear sunscreen wherever we go. <laughs> I promise to be a great dog dad to Kirby, and maybe even a real dad someday. I promise to never stop noticing the little things you do for me. And most importantly, I promise to dream with you, celebrate with you, and walk beside you through whatever our lives may bring. I love you. Well, um, just like our dog Kirby, I'll try to keep this short and sweet. <laughs> I first saw you that night seven years ago. Now here we are, getting married overlooking the city where we met and fell in love. In all of our tomorrows, I promise to engage as an equal partner in life, to share joys, sorrows, victories, and the hard work that goes into building a life together. I will pay loving attention to you and the little family we are creating. I will always be me, and you will always be you, but as long as we are together, it will always be us. I love you, Beba. Let's do this. <laughs> You have pledged yourselves to each other in the presence of your loving friends and family. So by the power vested to me by the state of Florida, I now declare you husband and wife 
Joshua, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's my privilege to present you for the first time as a married couple, the newlyweds, Desiree and Joshua. man told me long time ago for a long and prosperous marriage you need to comply with the two C's two C's the first C is communication and the second C is for compromise compromise Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you to raise your glasses again and toast to the newlyweds. Let's toast to Josh's decision, the best decision he has ever made. I wish you a lifetime of love, happiness, multiple cute little non-fur babies. And may your life be filled with happy memories to Desiree and Josh.